Yes, what is going on guys, Tim Chase here, and today's video is on what is my go-to post-workout meal. Now, there's three different ways I go about this. So, if I am in a rush, so let's say I'm trying to get a session in before I'm working, so I work in a gym, so I'll quickly smash out, let's say, a back session, and I've got like two minutes where I've got to start work, then I will just opt for whey protein. Now, I'll have that whey protein with water, just bang it down, maybe with a banana, and that's job done. Um, or I'll put some like instant oats, so they're like the blended oats in the shake, and obviously I have to make this up in advance, and um, just knock it down, and I'm good to go. That's my proteins and carbs sorted. If, however, I've got a bit more time, then I go for um, a bowl of oats with my protein powder. I love oats. There's, I don't think there's anything special about oats. I just love them. I can't help it. It's just I love a warm bowl of oats. If, however, I have a bit more time on my hands, I tend to not bother with the whey protein, and I'll actually you know, have some like uh, chicken or some chicken sausages, um, I probably have that with a nice big sort of green salad with a bit of like um, low calorie sauce and some spices and herbs. And I will probably have a bowl of oats again because, yeah, I love my oats. But um, if someone was cooking for me, then yeah, I'd probably have like sweet potatoes with it instead or something like that. Just I just can't help it. I don't know whether it's laziness, but it is, it is what it is. Um, if I am, um, you know, I've got it's like a day off and I fancy just treating myself and I'm not um, dieting for something and I'm just sort of maintaining um, my physique as I pretty much currently am, then sometimes I like to go a little bit higher calories and my favorite post-workout, again, it has to be something with a little bit of sweetness in, is going to be like some sort of all-day pancakes. So, you know, your classic kind of American uh, breakfast, so like the little fluffy American pancakes, obviously bigger the better, but I try and keep them pretty small so the calories don't go through the roof. Have that with maybe um, a bit of bacon, some, you know, sausage, um, like a, an egg or two, um, maybe some sort of maple syrup with that. So like I said, I like that sweetness and I just won't go overkill on it. Um, but with those meals, you can, you know, flex your calories from like 300 to 1,000 pretty easy, depending on the size of the pancakes, the amount of syrup used. But it's a, I find it's a good blend of protein and, and carbs. Um, and obviously, just I tend to be quite mindful of all, all the extra. If there are things like, I don't know, avocados or oils, um, egg yolk, because I don't go crazy on them post-workout. But again, I don't think it's the end of the world. I've got the simple sugars in there, I've got some good proteins and some fats maybe to slow it all down. And I'm not competing anymore. So, you know, I'm not too fussed about that kind of anabolic window. As long as I eat, you know, sensibly through the day and I get my calories in, um, I'm not too fussed. So yeah, that's kind of my, my go-to. I've got the, you know, my quick in a rush um, post-workout. I've then got my standard one, which is probably like chicken salad or chicken and greens and some porridge, just because that's me, because I'm weird. Um, and if I haven't got any food, I'll just chuck whey in instead of the chicken and the salad. And uh, yeah, then I would say I'd go for one of those kind of pancake brunch style, uh, like late breakfast for my post-workout, because I tend to train it in the morning. So. I hope that gives you some ideas. It's not the most creative, but it kind of gives you an insight into what I do post-workout. And um, yeah, I'm not a big fan of cereal. That's what I get asked all the time. I mean, I love cereal. Don't get me wrong. I get addicted to it, and that's the problem. If I have granola or cocoa pops or shreddies or something, then one bowl after workout will set me off, and I may start eating rubbish all day. It's just that I like the taste of something sweet, um, but the cereal is just you know just sets me off. Whereas um, the pancakes, not so much. It might be the extra fat in the, you know, the making of the fluffy pancakes, like the fact that I don't have an egg or bacon that's got fat in it, so it just slows the digestion down, and it just seems to not make me crave sweet food all day. It could just be the combination of like the sweet and the savoury as well. That might be what it is, to be honest. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit the like button, share it, comment, subscribe. You know the score, and I'll see you all at the next video. Ciao.